Hey everybody, Seth David here from the world famous Nerd Enterprises Incorporated and I'm so excited to bring you our first process and workflow design series in 2022. This one's on Airtable. So just like we did last year, each month there's a different topic. This month, January 2022, that topic is Airtable, which means there's going to be a live session, which is free for anyone who registers every Friday in January in 2022. Uh, February, we're going to be doing Notion, by the way. Uh, and as usual, there's an option for you to upgrade and get the workbooks. There's a workbook that comes with each lesson that I'm designing. And you can also get access to the recordings. And for those of you who are in my 97 and up program, you get access to all this included in your membership. So that's another way to get access to this and all of the other courses that we've done here under the heading of process and workflow design. Let's take a look at my screen. I'll show you what we're talking about. So on my left, you'll see the registration form. Very simple and straightforward. And you'll get a brief overview of what's included in the course. On the right, You'll see I've got the workbook all written out here for the first lesson on my introduction to Airtable. We're going to talk about setting up your first base. We're going to talk about what a base is. We're going to get into different tables, what those do, all the different kinds of fields. We're going to use a basic CRM as the use case just to give you something to work on to create your first base in case this is in case you're brand new to Airtable. Um, and then further down, we'll get into looking at how to create different kinds of views and how that all works. So the live registration for the course is free. If you want the workbooks, it's $37. That's just $37 for all four workbooks, one with each lesson. And then if you want to get the recordings, again, you can join 97 and up or you can pay the 197 for platinum access, which means you'll get the recordings. And if you do it while the, you know, before the sessions, the live sessions are completed, then that will also get you access to the live panel during the Zoom webinar so that you can ask questions live if you want to and just be part of that panel of participants. Otherwise, you'll be in the view only area where, of course, you can access the chat and ask questions and things that way. So that, my friends, is what it's all about. I do hope to see you in the course starting Friday, January 7th, 2022.